Hello, this is Nick from ReviewOutlaw.com. Today I'm going to show you how to windsurf uh, with the Bic Sport. It, this is a stand-up paddleboard, a surfboard, and also a windsurfer. Uh, so I've got my everything together here. There's a quick release here where you can push that and connect your sail. Um, that's good for storage if you just want to do some windsurfing. Put together my leash here. This is our Dewar harness. Today the wind is very not very powerful. You can see the sail has a slight bend to it. So uh, we'll just get out there. I'll give you a quick review on the sail. Um, and uh, yeah, you can see how it is to, to do it. If you've never done this before, definitely not going to get it on your first time. It's going to take uh, two or three days of good falls to figure it out. Um, you notice there's no center board. A lot of uh, wind servers have center board. That's going to give you more control to go upwind. It's a little bit harder to fight your way up wind with this. Um, so if this is your first time, definitely have some way you can get back to shore or like a jet ski or something to come rescue you in case you get into trouble. So uh, first thing I'm going to do is just going to drag it out a bit because the wind's going to pull me into this boat here. So I'm just going to pull this out. Just paddle it out. Your sail up. Take your time pulling your sail up to pull up nice and slow, and then just get all the water off here. Once you feel comfortable, get your footing next to the mast, back foot there, front hand here. You take you grab your back hand and just lean back into the wind. And slowly. You're gonna accelerate, you're gonna let your hand out if you feel like you're gonna fall, you're gonna let your back hand out. It's gonna slow you right down. Pull your back hand back in, speed yourself up. You can use your balance and your weight to accelerate. Just leaning back now. And you wanna to try to go upwind, because that wind's gonna to try to push you right back. And hopefully uh, no boats run you over. <laughs> Sailboats do have the right of way, but depending where you're going, depending <laughs> if they've been drinking, sometimes that can be a problem. Turn around here, tack, you go straight up wind, let it slow down, get your balance, and your feet around to the side. And we're gonna do the same thing on this side. And pull you back in the direction you want to go. Put your foot by that front mast, back foot a little bit further back. Lean back. Uh, there we are. That's a nice speed right now. The wind really pulls on this. Uh, it's a 5.5 meter, so not the largest, but almost the largest sail you can get. Don't need too much wind to get a good speed. A lot of fun. Sometimes it's nice just not to have to paddle, but paddling is uh, is also fun. You get a nice calm day. And you want to slow down. I'm just gonna kind of let off, let your back hand out. And I'm gonna making this look real easy when you go to try this yourself. If you've never done this. It's not going to be as easy as it seems. <laughs> and then just try to point yourself to where, to where you want to go. And you can just drop your sail back down. And that's about it. Um, overall, I do like this as a uh, kind of fun windsurfer. Um, compared to a real windsurfer, a real windsurfer, you know, full with the center board, you can be able to cut up wind much, much better. Um, the size of this board is nice. The feet pads here do hurt after you've been standing on it for maybe 45 minutes to an hour. That's going to start hurting your feet, the bottom of your feet. Something to be aware of when if wear booties. Um, and so the upwind thing is just something to consider. But for as far as a beginner to intermediate 
I think it's a great, great thing to learn on. Great thing just if you want to have some fun on the lake. Uh, you could definitely take it out in the ocean as well. Uh, the waves might knock you around a bit, but uh, definitely, you know, a good, good time. And just want to watch your sail and make sure that you don't get any rocks, you know, pointing to the sail. But all in all, that's about it. If you have any questions, just let me know in the bottom comments. If you like the video, please give me a thumbs up. Thanks.